A Wichita Falls man says his one-year-old dog Rambo is the reason he is living today after a nasty chainsaw accident. Rambo's owner, Johnny McKnight, says for a dog that wasn't trained at all, Rambo really came through, helping him to get to the porch and alerting his wife. Shantania Clark sat down with him. It was down in there like that. In my leg. Wichita Falls resident Johnny McKnight is recovering after his chainsaw got away from him and made a cut in his left leg so deep it was about a quarter inch away from his bone. Them trees that I done told down back over yonder, I was cutting them up in some kind of way or another, the saw that I was using. That's the, I don't know how it got me. McKnight began yelling for help, and that is when his one-year-old dog, Rambo, ran to the rescue. The only thing I felt was the cut, and it was digging, and it was just sitting right in there. McKnight says Rambo began nudging him, trying to get him to stand up, and he held on to his dog, while the dog held on to his pants with his teeth, and he began hopping to the front of the yard to find help. He had a hold of my pants right here. McKnight says when he saw how much blood he was losing, he thought it was all over for him, but it was not. Rambo helped to pull McKnight to the front of the house, pushed him to the steps at the front porch, and began barking, alerting McKnight's wife, who was taking a shower and was totally unaware of what her husband was going through outside. I heard a lot of commotion outside. The dogs were really barking. Um, kind of like I've never heard him bark before. It was really strange. And I was blessed to have that dog. I just, you know, I had to cry in my soul because that dog did. He saved me. He saved Shortly after Althea heard the dog, she heard her husband's cry for help, ran outside, and called 911. Both Johnny and Althea say they are grateful they have such a bright and courageous dog. Wow. How about yeah, really? that? It's kind of funny. We had, we just had, I'm pretty sure that was a boxer. Yeah, that we was just a had boxer, a boxer yeah. on the show. And I feel like there's a lot of like misconceptions yeah. with some like bigger dogs like that, like pit bulls and boxers and things yeah. like that. Um, that there's some kind of like vicious animal. Yeah. There and you, and you know what? I mean, it's, it's not like that at all. I mean, I, I, I'm a true believer in the idea yeah. that a dog is a man's best friend. And it is. That goes and to shot right there.